What is up YouTube, Jared Spalding here and today I'm going to be talking about just some new stuff that really needs to go on on this channel. So when you watch this channel, here's the first thing you need to know. I have not been, I'm not, I clearly you can tell I've not been some guy who's been investing for 50 years now. You know, I'm not some silver veteran or anything, I'm fairly new to silver myself and have fallen into many of the traps that I try to talk about avoiding on my channel, you know. And I recently had an interesting discussion, or discussion, which I don't like consider, you know, typing back and forth a discussion, but anyway, it was an interesting discussion with some guy who's been collecting for over 40 years, and he was basically saying how a lot of the information in my videos was incorrect. Now, let me just say that I can't say he's wrong. Okay. I myself have been told some fake information. You know, I look up things that I talk about on my videos, but a lot of people like to post fake, fake articles, articles that they think are real. Kind of like how what happened with my videos. You know, I was basing them off the information that I was led to believe was real and really it was not. And let me just say, I am extremely sorry for this. You know, any problems that my videos have caused for any of you, please let me know. I, I'm, you know, I, I'm not like I have a very big audience or anything, so it's not really too much of a problem for people, people being like, hurt or anything, but, you know, anything that has caused you problems, please let me know, and I am sorry for it. Um, some of the information, like I said, I've been told is fake or just misleading, and then my videos become misleading for other new investors, which really is not fair to anybody, you know, and like I said, very sorry. Uh, please do remember a lot of silver stacking is your own personal opinions, like predictions and experiences with companies. You know, like I said, I'm not the most experienced buyer. By any means, am I even close to being a, the most experienced? Uh, you know, I haven't been investing for too long, and I don't have a ton of money to throw into investing because, well, I don't have, you know, a regular job or anything, obviously. And... You know, this causes me to not be as experienced as some of you may like, and I am sorry for that. From now on, please know all my information will be more thoroughly checked. And I never in my videos do I try to tell you that you should do these things. I'm really just trying to advise. There's things I think are good. You know, like one of the things this guy said that he was saying I did wrong was with investing or just just as buying, let's just say that, buying coins from companies that, like grading companies that nobody ever heard of. He called them, uh, I believe, Junker Slabs, or gar some, Garage Slabs, something like that. And he said how these companies are trying to rip me off, they're all fake and everything, you know? And that really, I think, is a matter of opinion because I have never had a bad experience buying from a smaller company. You know, with PCGS, you're going to be paying such a huge premium on the coin that it's not really worth it. And also, PCGS does give their coins higher grades. Some people may try to tell you that they grade more thoroughly. Well, PCGS, being such a large company, is trying to make as much money as possible. Why do you think they send back some coins? Like, if you try to get them graded, they send them back. They still take your money. They don't no big company cares about the consumer and despite popular belief they're not they don't care about your interest they care about their interest which is their pocketbook but regardless of all of this i am sorry for any of misleading information and any way i can help you out you know please let me know like i said i mean really experience will come with time as I get older, I'll have more experience in silver investing and I'll be able to form my own opinions. A lot of them are formed off of what other people say, and that is wrong. But, you know, I shouldn't be preaching what I can't even practice myself, at least not in the 
financial position that I am in myself, you know, I'm in no means able to purchase hundred ounce silver bars in any form. So I'm, I mean, I'm sorry. I hope that you are able to feel a little bit better now, knowing that my information will be much more thoroughly checked and everything will be okay. And that's it for today. Peace, love, and much respect.